Good evening. Well, Stan the Man Musial is more than a household name in St. Louis. Stan Sanchez is Pueblo baseball. The current head coach just picked up his 701st win as manager of CSU Pueblo. And the journey? Well, I'll let you coach Sanchez tell you all about that. When you walk into Rawlings Field in Pueblo, you can't help but notice all the banners and signs. They all tell a story, the history of a team with memories for life. A team led by head coach Stan Sanchez for 21 years. A coach with wins that no coach in the history of the Armac can match. What he's created here is, is uh, you know, it's, it's historical, obviously, 700 wins in the Armac and over 1,000. I mean, it's just... It's unbelievable what he's done. When you reach a milestone of 700 wins, it's hard to pick a true winner. That is until you talk to him about one year in particular. His smile tells it all. The one is the Wichita State story. They were ranked number one in the country, okay, our first year in 94. And we got invited to play them, okay, to go to Wichita State and play. It would be like our football team going to Alabama, okay? And we beat them. And he remembers it like it was yesterday. Wichita State was loaded with talent. The catcher, Doug Marabelli, played, played for the Red Sox. Casey Blake at third base played for the Dodgers. You know, their pitcher ended up being 12-1 and one that year and gave him his only loss. So, yeah, that's the story that I like to talk about. The characters in his story are the players and coaches that he fathered, a fraternity like no other. Our alumni always, always, uh, you know, are watching out for us. We hear from them all the time. Uh, you can look at our stadium, and they're full of incredible players. But no wins can match being able to coach your own son. Now that is special, no matter how you look at it. Well, and I look at that, and 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 he he did a great. He was on a championship team, so it's. I mean, I, it's a storybook for me. So while this story is yet to be a closed book, it's a real page turner, filled with memories and a history that put the sport on the map for CSU Pueblo. Anything is possible. I want to win a national championship. Uh, that's the that's what drives you. Only time will tell if this particular story has a fairy tale ending. And it's always a pleasure to sit down and just talk with Stan because he, I mean. Just the knowledge of baseball mm -hmm. and that he can tell you is just amazing. And he just loves the sport of baseball. You, you just talk to him about baseball, and a smile comes on his face, and there's something about baseball. Maybe not just Stan, but a lot of people, too. Uh, talking about baseball just puts a smile on your face. And it's America's pastime, right? Yeah, and you know, we can always only be so lucky to have a job where it's our passion, it's our love, and exactly. also be so successful at it. I mean, what is it, six times over 40 wins? Yeah, yeah. And, and to do it that many years, for 21 years, an average of 35 wins per season, remarkable accomplishment by him. And he's still going. He yeah, said going he strong. hopes to go a long time as well. Absolutely.